Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today is going to be something a little bit different. I'm going to be doing a video primarily focused on my kind of like self-care sustainable routine that I have started for myself. This is going to be me showing you guys a few ways that I've started incorporating Arm & Hammer baking soda into my routine. And this video is actually going to be sponsored by Arm & Hammer baking soda. So thanks so much to them. And let me tell you why I'm so excited to talk about this. One of the easiest things that you can do is recycle. No matter what form of Arm & Hammer baking soda you buy, recycling is always easy. Arm & Hammer baking soda boxes are made from 100% recycled materials and are fully recyclable at home. This, which I love, the Arm & Hammer baking soda shaker, is actually designed to be refilled and reused over and over again so that you can reduce waste. When you're done using it, you just discard the label and recycle the bottle. Now for the baking soda pouches, Arm & Hammer is actually partnered with TerraCycle. And if you don't know what TerraCycle is, they are a world leader in the collection and repurposing of waste. So through this partnership, you can send in your used Arm & Hammer baking soda pouches for or free to TerraCycle where they will be broken down and repurposed to make other materials instead of ending up in landfill. Now I'm going to show you some of the ways that I've actually started incorporating Arm & Hammer baking soda into my routine. Tons of cute little self-care tips for around the house and for yourself that I feel have made all the difference and make me feel like I'm reducing my waste. So let's jump into that part. matcha spoon on the counter and it left some matcha stains so I'm gonna just put a little bit of Arm & Hammer powder on the counter to clean it up. Voila! The counter is completely clean again. So actually, my first way that I love using Arm & Hammer baking soda, and I feel that this is a hack a lot of people don't know about, is adding some of the baking soda to my shampoo to make it more of a clarifying shampoo. A lot of people don't realize that this is a really great way to really get a good deep clean out of your hair. And if you're someone that uses a lot of styling products or hair products, it's a really great way to add that clarifying aspect to remove any of that residue that kind of can linger and stay behind that shampoo on its own is not always able to get unless you shampoo the living heck out of your hair. Another really great use for Arm & Hammer baking soda is actually just adding a teaspoon of baking soda with half a glass of water and using this as a mouth rinse right after brushing your teeth. It's able to neutralize any of those odors that you might have and really keep your breath feeling nice and fresh. And the last thing that I do in my self-care routine is make an exfoliating face mask using baking soda and honey. It actually helps my skin feel so soft and so smooth and you're using natural ingredients. So what I do is I take one and a half teaspoons of honey and I mix that with two tablespoons of baking soda. Just mix it up really well and apply it to my face, making sure to avoid your eyes obviously and the area around them. And I just leave this mask on for about 10 minutes and then I remove it with a warm damp cloth. I will say it's not recommended to use this mask more than one to two times a week. Use it sparingly and as a part of your self-care routine. As with any product, do not apply on any broken or irritated skin. If you have sensitive skin, it's definitely advisable to use caution and maybe test out a small portion on your skin first before proceeding with a full face mask. All right, that's gonna be it for this video. I do really need to get on with the rest of my day, but I do hope that you guys enjoyed this. It felt really good sharing these ways with you guys and it was really exciting for me to get the chance to work with Arm & Hammer Baking Soda. It is literally a household name and product that has been around in my life and with my family for literally years and years and years. I would love to know if there are any things that you do with baking soda to incorporate into your routine to make your life easier. I would love to hear that in the comments below. I'm definitely like, I don't think I really realized all the different uses that could come out of it. If you guys have any other things that you'd recommend trying, let me know. And also let me know if you try out the stuff that I said, cause I feel like it was really cool and definitely could help some people spruce up their routine in some way. So thanks again so much for watching. I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.